Good morning, everyone. Lost Nala this morning. Oh, do you like my woodland PJs, Matalan? I lost Nala, and I was thinking, she's barking at something, and I know what she's barking at. Oh, what are you barking at? She's barking. Show them what you're barking at. I did my PO box yesterday, and in it were these um, vegetarian dog food veggie burger bites. Oh, these look cool, blueberry sticks. But I gave her one yesterday, and now she just keeps coming up here and barking at the bag. How did I know you would be here? You can have one, but you will not have one at the bag, because I don't want you thinking if you bark at the bag, then you can have one. Oh, got to put me autumn wreath on the door. We'll have it downstairs, come on. Not at me. You know, let's put you up on. Oh, I bought this bench um, from West Elm. How cute is that? It's for us to put our shoes on because we didn't have anything to sit on to put our shoes on apart from the stairs. So I got this and I really love it. Up. You can get up there. Up. Sit. Sit. Oh, a little lie down. That's cute. Good girl. So I'm gonna have a banana and I'm gonna clean the kitchen. And then I think I'm gonna make a coffee. I don't normally eat coffee, as you know. Eat coffee, drink coffee. It's still too early. There is one type of coffee that is an exception. And I'll show you what it is after this. So these are the coffees that I love. They're the Grand Cafe Collection World of Flavours. You can get them in TK Maxx and Home Sense, and they are so good. I've not tried Cinnabon or Candy Corn flavour. Sweet and cream with a touch of fluffy marshmallow. Uh, yeah. I have, though, tried this one. I got this one last year, and I was gutted when I realised that... Um, I couldn't keep it for another year because it coffee goes off. <laughs> so, actually, where's the best before date? Okay, we've got this one for quite a while. It's delicious, and I'm so glad I managed to find another one. So yeah, these are the three coffees. I don't know which one to make, but I might make one for me and Alfie. I make them very milky, that's the only thing. <laughs> got my little Halloween mug, and I think... We're gonna go for the candy corn. I don't know if he wants this coffee or a different one. So I'm gonna make enough for him to have some, but ultimately I just wanna try it. <laughs> what? The noise in your bowl, my coffee. Yeah, I know, too. feel her body relaxing. Is that nice? You in a little cuckoo. Oh my god, I would love that. Lie down then. Oh! oh. <laughs> also, coffee verdict. I made it really bad. <laughs> Didn't I? You plunged it at the wrong time. You plunged, I it, plunged too early. it too quickly, Straight so away. it just doesn't really taste of anything. What are our plans for today? Well, to I want to take some Morty. pictures. Alfie wants to watch Rick and Morty. I want, oh my god, that's so cute. Um, I really want to take some pictures. I want to put Nala in a mound of 
leaves. I don't know if she'll actually sit in a mound of leaves though. <laughs> um, it's because I saw someone did it with their cat. So I really want to do it with Nala. And I also want to decorate the house. And I want to film a video. Oh, and I've also had a really big delivery from Next and John Lewis, which I will open in my vlog. Look at this doggy. She was running in her sleep and her paws were like... Can you see her? Her paws were going up and down. Oh, sorry Nala. Oh, I love this cuddle. This is like a family cuddle. Close your eyes. Go sleep. Right, I am going to make some scrambled eggs on toast because I really feel like eating that. Bit of pepper, bit of salt. Yummy. I've now put my face on and got dressed from the waist up to film my autumn clothing haul, which I assume you will have seen by the time you watch this vlog. But yeah, I'm excited to film it. There is a lot of stuff to show. And it's only really when I gathered it all up to put in the video that I was like, this is quite a lot. Thank heavens I cleared my wardrobe before I bought this because I would not have space for it. This is the setup. I've just made all this bed because I had to strip the bedding in here a couple of days ago and get all that like um, washed and ironed etc. I was like, I need to make the bed up anyway because I can't have like an unmade bed in the background of a video. That would be really weird. And it looks so nice. I found these from last year. These were Asda. And they're like brushed cotton with little hedgehogs on and I really love them. Um, and then I've got the cushion that was from Asda last year. This which is Home Sense this year I think. And my little autumn tree. And the lights and then the throws next. And Home Sense. Right, I have just finished filming the try on set whoa there we go the try on section of my haul and dear god duh. this is why i don't usually do try ons in hauls because my hauls are too big and the try on took me about an hour and a half to film so i had my camera up out here um and this is some of the aftermath yep yep <laughs> And then the rest of the aftermath of filming. I'm really not looking forward to tidying all this away if I'm completely honest with you. <gasps> oh, this hat is my Zona Lifestyle hat, by the way. I freaking love it. Let's tidy. Help! <laughs> because it looks really autumnal but also I'm really digging this outfit. This t-shirt is by New Look and it says let's brunch. The jacket is ASOS but it's Bershka. The trousers are ASOS and the shoes are Topshop. Let's go outside. We've just taken some photos some of them of Nala next to a pumpkin and they're so cute. I think what I might do now is put a little autumnal outfit on her or maybe like a pumpkin outfit and take some more pics but i don't know where i really want like a massive mound of leaves but we don't actually have that many leaves might have more at the front maybe on the driveway 
but oh yeah there's quite a few out there actually i might do that i've tried to make it all like festive to take some pictures of her and she looks so flipping cute come here sit sit very good girl sit down Now you're gonna sit, sit, good girl, wait, wait, good girl, good girl, wait, wait, good girl, wait, good girl. Okay, and um, we're done, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> it's a little bit later now and I've scraped my hair back into this joyous little Thing, and I've decided I'm gonna throw myself a bath because it's one of those evenings where I want to get cozy. <laughs> I can't even tell you how much I am looking forward to getting in this bath, but also it's really raining. Oh my God, look, <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's really raining on this um, window and it sounds so relaxing. So I am excited to put a bit of YouTube on and get in my bath. Are you gonna sit on my towel? You cutie. Out the bath, I've done my evening skincare and now I am watching some Rhiannon and Ashley vlogs. If you guys don't watch her vlogs, I highly, highly recommend you do. They're always like a really good long length and as you know, my vlogs are really long but I think that's also because I really enjoy watching very long vlogs as well and they're perfect for like if you're doing something around the house or you're having a bath because you don't have to keep going to your laptop to find videos so hers are great for that because they're always really long like the longer they are the more excited I get but also she's just very like calm and her vlogs are just really nice to watch if you're like having a chill a chill out time so I definitely recommend her channel if any of you want some more vlogs to watch I am wearing some new pajamas <laughs> You guys, next is just so good right now. Let me show you. Where can I show you? Hmm. Look, it has little squirrels on it, and then the top has a little acorn on the pocket, which I really like. And then this dressing gown is from Next as well, and it has bunny ears. It's like the the filter but yeah i'm very cozy this is the first time this end of the year that i have whipped a dressing gown out i was really strict and i threw away all my dressing gowns because they were manky i don't know why i was holding on to those they were so so gross so yeah i got this from next it's a nice length as well let me just stand back so you can see it Alfie has gone out for dinner with his friend so I'm gonna watch some more Rihanna and Ashley vlogs and then I think I am going to carry on watching a series on ITV called Liar. A few people have actually told me to watch this and then last night when we went to see Mark he was like you need to watch Liar you'd absolutely love it so I was like oh my god I need to watch it. So last night when I got in I started watching it and it's really good. I feel like I was telling Alfie about it when I was half asleep when he came in. Well, maybe I was telling him this morning. I don't remember. But um, either way, it's really, really great. So I think I'm going to carry on watching this vlog and then I'm going to continue watching Liar. And then, guys, I think I'm going to go to sleep. So good night for now and I'll see you in the morning. <laughs> Good morning, it is Sunday and it is the 1st of October. Do you want to go on a... Do you want to go on a... Do you want to go on a walk? 
It is a really rainy, miserable day today. One of those days where I've just thrown on a really cozy jumper, can't be bothered with makeup today, can't really even be bothered to do anything to my hair. We are, however, crazy enough in this rainy, miserable weather to take this little one on a walk. Yes, I keep saying it and your eyes keep getting wide. Let's go then. Because it's so rainy and she's so small and close to the ground, we will have to put a little coat on her so that she doesn't get as wet as she would if we didn't put a coat on her. Hello, Percy. Hello, mister. You got some on your nose. Let me get it off. Can I stroke you? Oh, is that nice? Oh. We're on our walk and it looks like Alfie's picking up a dog poo, Actually, but, he but he's not. He's picking up all the conkers, look. What are you eating, Nala? I don't think you're supposed to eat them. There's so many. There's another one. Oh my God. They're like quite big round here as well because they're all buried under the... There's so many. I love looking for conkers. It's like my favourite pastime. <laughs> Conker picking. You used to like put them in vinegar and stuff when you were younger. No, what would you put them in vinegar for? To strengthen them. So then when you play conkers. Oh, I never played conkers. It was banned in our school, I think. You it never was, played. It was too dangerous for the Laycock kids. There's some huge boys down here. Oh look, this one's still in the casing. Nala's so confused though. She's like, guys, what are you doing? Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, we can like wash them all when we get back. It's quite nice listening to the sound of the rain on the trees, isn't it? And thinking that. maybe I we're go camping. the only two crazy people that have decided to walk their dog today. <laughs> There's like no one around. Guys, this is like a conquer, like massacre. They are just like demolished in this tiny little road. Massive. But we're finding so many. You have a big one. That's a dog, but it's warm. It's warm. Please take it out of my hand. Stop it. It's a good job that's not the dog poo bag. Look at it, it's bulging. That would be like your mum's dog. Yeah, like literally, a, lab. a Labrador. Look, there's so many. I'm going to get them out and then we can stand on them and get them out of the... There's another one. I mean, it's not conquer picking unless you can open some of them, is it? One Just bit. very lightly. You don't want to... That's it. <gasps> Yay! No, get off. Yay! Look, this one's a double. Oh my God, Alfie, get... look. There's a tiny, tiny one. one. <gasps> Yay! Back from our walk now and it was really, really nice. I have a Maltesers hot chocolate. Mmm. I thought I'd ordered whipped cream and I thought I had marshmallows. Turns out the marshmallows went off in June and I didn't order whipped cream so I must have done that in my sleep. But cheers. This is way too hot to drink yet so I'm going to put it down on the side and have it in a minute. I have just prepared dinner. I am making from Jamie Oliver's new book, Five Ingredients. There he is, happy as Larry. I'm making the comforting sausage bake. So hopefully what I have put in here will come out looking something like this. <laughs> Fingers crossed. The oven is beeping away. So hopefully this looks good. Oh, it looks good. <laughs> I think that is a great success, personally. Good morning, everybody. It is Monday, and I have thrown on a hoodie this morning, not really looked in the mirror, because I knew I was coming up here to sort out <laughs> this room. I told myself this room would never get messy. 
that's not quite what's happened as you can see um i had a p.o box delivery recently there's actually some like really cool things in here look at this mew mew sent me a freaking handbag very very generous of them thank you so much i also have another one by coach which is gorgeous oh my god this is so like autumn winter i love it this is the mean girls spectrum brushes um collection how cool are these brushes i freaking love them and i also just love this there's some really lovely things in here um that i need to put away i also cleared my cupboards out of all of last year's christmas stuff and put all of this year's christmas so we've got like the lifestyle lifestyle a little bit of beauty and then beauty along the bottom but that took me a long long time and now i just need to work out where i'm gonna put these because yeah i think in the attic but then the attic is pretty full already which i do need to sort out also let the time lapse commence why does this camera zoom in no day now and I still look like I've been dragged through a hedge backwards but I have made some progress on that room it's pretty much tidy the only thing I did then start doing was dragging everything out of my attic and sorting through it so that's like Halloween decorations Christmas decorations just because I buy new stuff every year but I don't necessarily use that time to get rid of previous year's stuff so every time I bring new things out I'm like, oh, after this Christmas, I need to make sure I sort through it, and then I never do. So that's what I was trying to do just then. And when I was doing that, I got this out, and I finally put it up, and I freaking love it. Ta da! On the front door! It looks so cute. I am obsessed very autumnal and then in here I just put this little one up on the kitchen door just because I thought it was so cute it's like orange berries love it right I wanted to edit a vlog but Alfie has taken all of the memory card readers with him because he will no doubt have a couple in his bag and he took mine this morning so it's making life a little bit difficult because I can't edit my vlog is there one in here? No, guys, this is turning into a drawer where we just chuck stuff. I have a lot of packages that I need to open and go through. Oh, where have I put my knife? There it is. And I'm not going to lie to you guys, a lot of these are Christmas decorations. So from next, I got gold tree in a glass. Ta da! How cute is that? This house is bigger than our other house. And so I planned where I think I want Christmas trees. Um, and the ceilings are a lot higher here. So our Christmas trees can be bigger. And I'm not going to lie. If a Christmas tree can be bigger, then obviously it's going to be bigger. Like I'm not going to... I'm not going to stick to a smaller one just because. Wowza. I don't know where I'm gonna put these ones, but they're so cool. This kind of reminds me of the Play Days owl. I've forgotten what she's called. You may be thinking, Zoe, it's way too early for Christmas. And you're right. And actually so far this year, I've been way more restrained. I only listened to Christmas music last week. The year before that, I was listening to Christmas music in June or July. I'm not even kidding. I also have not watched any Christmas films apart from I did watch um, It's a Wonderful Life, but I'd never seen that before. And 
it was okay. I kind of liked it. I mean, I did fall asleep. I had a really bad headache, so I can't give like a proper review on it. Look at these. Aren't they cool? It's full of like colorful confetti. So you might be thinking it's really early. That's fine. You can think that. Um, but if it's in the shops, and you see it and you like it, you have to buy it now, otherwise they're just all gone. That's my advice for you today. If you see it, get it, or it's gone. <gasps> okay, I also got some that look like this. These are all still next, by the way. <gasps> oh my God, look how pretty this looks when the sun goes on it in the box. <gasps> that is so cool. It's like a bag of bones. This is a lawn skeleton. It includes one head, two arms, two legs, and five stakes. Jeez. I thought that would be quite funny. Oh, cute. I got these for place names. Me and Alfie are doing Christmas here this year, so it's up to me to set the table and do all the cute little bits and pieces. So that is what I'm going to do. I ordered these because I want to put uh, loads of white paper decorations up the stairs like on the banisters these look tiny they are tiny that's not useful <laughs> oh that's more like it giant snowflake decorations thank you now this is only a sneak peek but me joey and daniel are doing a us versus uk halloween decor and treats swap which I'm very excited about. So quite a few bits in here are for them and to go in their box. So I got a Boo garland kit and I've also got a Merry Merry Party garland. This is like the cutest brand like ever. So I thought they would really like some of those. I've just had my lunch and now I've got the Kardashians on and I'm about to go through this massive John Lewis box. And I've just remembered, I've just remembered another theme for one of the Christmas trees is gold, purple and green. Okay, so I bought this sprig because it was cute. Oh my god, how beaut are these? Ta-da! This style on John Lewis is, um, oh. It's called Into the Woods, and it is so cute. I also bought 20 glass decorations in this, oh, which I have to hook. They've got the little hooks in the bottom though, so that's fine. So I've got 20 of those to go with it. I got 28 mini ones, again, of like the same colours. I got some gold ferns, and I also got... This, which is like autumn leaves oh, with gold on. I just thought these were so cute. They're garlands and they've got little gold um, acorns and little pine cones on them. Sticking with the woodland theme. I thought I could drape those like around the Christmas tree. I thought these were so cute. I got three of these. They're like little tapestry snowflakes how cute are they i thought they would look really nice in like a garland somewhere i got these for the green purple and gold christmas tree they are little i thought they were so cute and i love that they're on a peg so you can stand them up little purple mushrooms and you just peg it in the tree upright these are for the gold green and purple tree how pretty look it has loads of gold stars in oh my god this one is beautiful isn't that so beautiful again that is for the purple green and gold tree i also got oh my god so much glitter oh I also got this one, which is green pine cones with gold. Oh my gosh, this one is so pretty. 
look at this one. It's very abstract and it has glitter on it. I bought a copper wire star for the top of one of the trees. I'm really lacking in things to go on top of trees. So if you know anywhere that does cool tree toppers, then let me know. This one, which again, I think is so pretty. So pretty. John Lewis always have really, really beautiful um, decorations, I think. This is another one from the Into the Woods and it's just clear with this gold leaf on it. Um, I don't know whether I'll put those in this one or whether I'll put these with just like gold, silver and white tree maybe. And then very similar to the next ones, in fact, very similar to the next ones, I didn't realize, we have these but these are completely covered and glued on the inside and they are like some of the one of the coolest freaking baubles i have ever seen i also got this one which i love oh, is a garland which has oh, which already has coppery baubles on, which I will for sure be having a coppery Christmas tree somewhere, so these will go with that, which I really like. They're all very twisted though, so we need to lay them out. And that is everything. And now I need to tidy this away because if Alvy comes back and sees this, I think he will cry. 